black owned. It's about business, our business, our culture, creating legacies. See us, hear us, support the movement. We are black owned. Recording. We are here with the Sapphire Boutique March Madness brunch, right? So with Black Home Recording, we started to basically shine a light on black entrepreneurs and show the well show our community that we still care. So the videos on this channel focus on entrepreneurs and their businesses. So we are blessed with Michelle, who is not only a entrepreneur of one business, but a multiple entrepreneur. So we're gonna start off with you introducing yourself to the people. Hi, my name is Michelle. Um, I own Fire We Chef 2021 and also Sapphire Boutique, also Michelle Arcade. So tell me a little bit about, well, first of all, we gotta talk about Black Wall Street. How did you get to Black Wall Street? Black owned. <laughs> I think all black people need to own something, mm -hmm. some way, somehow, make a lot of money and keep it home and keep growing. So this is kind of like a uh, chicken before the egg kind of question. <laughs> so which one came first? Um, Sapphire. Well, Michelle Arcadian. So Michelle Arcadian. So how did that get started? Um, I love to cook. Um, I'm a chef. Uh, I've worked at many places. I've worked at U.S. Open. I've worked at Terrace on the Park doing weddings. I've worked a lot, a lot of places. A, a lot, a lot of places. So from catering, you were like, you know, I'm going to do something a little smaller, and then you're going to start with Fiery Chef. Right. So tell me about Fiery Chef. Um, I got laid off. So <laughs> COVID gave everyone a push. Gave everyone I got a laid butt. off, and I um, started selling clothes. But I realized it was something slow, and I started selling something else, which is defense weapons. It was good, but it's not my passion. My passion is cooking. So um, at that point, I said, you know what? I seen a friend post a new upcoming April 3rd uh, um, food vendors pop up in Brooklyn. Um, and then I said, you know what? I want to do that. So I turned around and I discovered Fiery Chef. So we have the start of Fiery Chef, we, start, we have the start of the catering business, and then we have Sapphire Boutique. So what is Sapphire Boutique? Um, it's a boutique for women. So everything, clothes, you know, um, lingerie, um, a lot of sexy lingerie. <laughs> <laughs> and as well, you know, for men, get out of line, a little defense with them. Oh, yeah. I mean, listen, there's some people who are into that, but, you know, the, the other way. But, you know, basically, you're like, I got you covered. <laughs> so what does it mean to you that you are a multi like a multi business entrepreneur, I should say. Um, it means a lot because I want to teach my kids that you can have your own. You don't necessarily have to work for someone, you can work for yourself. So if I want to find out what's cooking in your pot, where am I going? You'll go to my uh, my Instagram, Fiery Chef. You can DM me. Also, I do. Um, I put out my logo. It's not a big So, you know, you can come on, ask me for my name. Um, I'm on um, Facebook at Michelle R. Kaler, and I have a link as well as I have you know. Um, yeah, I want around the chef side. Yeah, you know, side hustle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. You know, I have chefs as friends, so all I do is make fun. You know, it's easy. Okay. <laughs> so, if I need a special request, I can just come to you. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So, what is so I do the segment called a shameless plug segment. Okay. So the shameless plug is the what's next, what can we expect from you, what do you do? So what do you want to shamelessly plug out? Instagram, you can find me at Fiery Chef 2021. 
um, Sapphire from Sushi Family, Sapphire S A P P period H R R E Boutique, um, and on Facebook, it's on our page. Um, and then you can call me, 845 And that's right on the mark. Yes. So, what are your final words for people? Black on. <laughs> Black Wall Street, we all got to own something, we all got to do. At the end of the day, we all out here, all hustling, but hustling, hustling honestly. So with that being said, own something, put your name on something, I'll, I'll see it. So once again, I am here with Michelle, with Black Wall Street, Sapphire Boutique, Fiery Chef, and the last one, the catering one. Michelle, Michelle, named after herself, <laughs> own something. So thank you so much for letting me interview you. Thank you. Well, when I you appreciate it. When you are out of state, are you going to come back and give me another interview? I will try. Yes, <laughs> of course. So thank you so much. Um, do you have anything else you want to drop to the people? Um, come out and shop, support, support, support pop-ups, like on pop-ups. Support every vendor. All of us are out here trying to support, support, support. And the last thing I completely forgot, we're at your you you organize this pop-up shop. Yes. So I feel like there are more coming. So when we're gonna see the next one? The next one is April 10th at the same location, 183 Hagerman Avenue. Um that'll be in the morning. Yeah, in the morning. And then um you'll catch me at many pop-ups. I'm everywhere. Bronx, Manhattan, Long Island, New Jersey, Brooklyn, Queens, Staten Island, I'm everywhere. You are everywhere. So this is Michelle everywhere. So I can't wait to see all the great things that you accomplished. I am speaking it into existence for you. Oh my God, thank you so much. I appreciate you, guys. Girl, after this, I'm going to a plate. <laughs> we have a lot. <laughs> It's, it's the red, red velvet waffles for me. <laughs> so if you guys like this video, make sure you guys like, you comment, and you subscribe. So this is Mystified signing off. I'm shining. 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 I'm shining.